So it's 20th of March today. I just wanted to talk to you about my pepper growing production line. I've done a couple of production line videos over the last few weeks. And so these are the peppers. These are the ones that started 12th of December. So they've been growing pretty well. They're pretty big now. Um, and, you know, they're really going to benefit from being planted out. This greenhouse is going to be heated from now on and peppers need it fairly warm. I'm going to warm it, heat it to about 10 degrees centigrade at night, something like that. And then as we get into April, probably increase the temperature a little bit to sort of 13 or something like that, because uh, that's the sort of temperature that maximizes fruit set on peppers at night. So um, yeah, I've got four different varieties. I've got Long Yellow Ringo, Yellow Dream, Akron, can't remember them all. Bright Star and yeah, I think that's it. So um, the way I like to do it is I prepared all the containers here. Moist compost, not wet. Uh, all of these have been watered already. I've put pots in and firmed the compost down around the pots. Pots are obviously the same size as the peppers. And uh, yeah, so let's just turn all these out, see what we've got. Just give it a bit of a squeeze and hoping for lots of roots. There we go. Actually, not bad. Pretty happy with that. Uh, I only potted these on, I don't know, two, three weeks ago, something like that. And you can see how fast they're growing. So just drop them in and that's lovely now. So they, those roots will go seeking out uh, more moisture now in the rest of the pot. And I won't water the pot now for probably three or four days just to get the roots out of the old original root ball. And I've got some nice uh, willow stakes I'm going to use to support them and have got grow lights down here as well. So I'll be giving them a little bit of a grow light boost because I want them to think that it's currently May instead of March. And uh, yeah, and so in May, we need a day length. Let me just see. <laughs> Can I remember? Like 16 hours, I think, is uh, the day length in May. So, yeah, so that's kind of what I'm going to give them rather than, I don't know what they're getting at the moment, 12 or something like that in terms of natural light. But I won't use the grow lights at all um, other than to just extend the day. So I've got another eight peppers that I want to put in here in April. I'm going to put them down this side here, basically the same sort of setup. Uh, and I've got my tomatoes in here, tomatoes and strawberries and all that sort of thing as well. So it's getting pretty cramped in here. Um, this is a pipeline video. So I just wanted to talk about the pepper pipeline. So these are my first plants. And as I say, these are the ones that probably start harvesting in June, I should think, um, and probably only for these, I only want just fresh peppers to eat in salads, basically, or chopped up into a stir fry or something like that. Um, the main crop peppers, I've got another oh, 36 of those uh, to go out under my low, in the low tunnels on the allotment, and they are just this big at the moment, so they're only about three weeks old, something like that. So. Uh, that's it. And I won't do any late peppers. I don't find that uh, I need to do late peppers because peppers tend to do really well, well into October. Uh, and so that's just fine. Some of these uh, will go outside onto the patio in so probably at the middle of June, July, something like that. And some of them will stay in this greenhouse for their whole lives.